Welcome back everyone. In this lesson we are going to be uh, starting to create our terrain. Um, this is just going to be a basic terrain that we can put inside of Unity and then split up. Okay, so the program we are going to be using for this is called L3DT and this is just a terrain creation uh, program that you can download for free online. Um, and it's just going to allow us to quickly create a detailed terrain like the one you can see in the image there. Um, alternatively, if you do want a more advanced um, solution you could use world machine but we're just going to go with L3DT for now so I'm going to hop on the website and show you how you can download it here I am on the website it's uh, www.bundysoft.com slash L3DT and when we're on here we just want to go up to the downloads button here to download screen and we just want to download the standard edition yep so just download the current stable release right here and after this you'll have to go through a bit of an installer it's just like any other installer and when that's done you should be able to uh, start up the program alright so my download has finished and I have the program open now alright so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna create a basic terrain we're not gonna go too advanced in all the different options and settings we're just gonna create a terrain that we can easily put into Unity and use alright so first thing I wanna do is go and click on this button here which is the uh, create new terrain button click on that and here we just want to select the uh, designable map so we'll click next uh, we'll click next now these options we don't really need to go through in detail we can just skip through all these so we can just go next uh, next and here in the calculation queue what we want to have is the height field and the texture map so let's just enable uh, actually we'll just enable all these just so I can show you so but the ones we do need is the height field so we can actually have a height map which can then generate uh, the actual terrain model inside of Unity and the texture map to of course apply a texture to the terrain so we can click next 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 uh, next 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 and OK and it should then begin to uh, generate our map um, this can take a bit of time it will probably take under a minute hopefully but it can take around a minute or so so I'll get back to you when it's finished okay here we are my map has generated and here in the texture map we can actually see what it looks like and we can switch through these different tabs here we can see the salinity map uh, the attributes map you can even see the terrain normals to have like a normal map of where the mountains are where all the uh, valleys in that are we also have a height map which is one of the things that we do need uh, there are these colored lines though in the image um, but when we do import it into unity uh, there won't be those uh, so just think of a height map as pretty much showing you where the uh, terrain is high and where it is low so the darker the terrain is the lower down it is yet the uh, whiter it is the higher it is and so when we put this inside of unity into our terrain uh, I can calculate pretty much each pixel, see how it ranges from 0 being black and 1 being totally white, how it ranges between them, and then set that at its certain height depending on how bright it is. And so then we can actually have a quite a, a detailed terrain that way. And then after that we'll apply our texture map on top of that, so we can have a pretty good looking detailed texture. Okay, so how do we actually import these into Unity? Well, what we need to do is right click on texture map here and just click on export layer. Um, we'll actually save this file format as a PNG and then we'll save it inside of our Unity project. So just locate your Unity project and inside of the assets, uh, inside of the assets um, folder, I'm just going to create a new folder here and call it our terrain. And inside here, I'm just, oops, no, there, inside our terrain folder, I'm just going to name this uh, our terrain texture. Save that. And make sure that the width and height is uh, 1024. And then we'll click OK. And with that saved, we then want to go and save our height map. So we can right click on that, go export layer. But thing is with this, we don't want to save it as a PNG. And that is because the new Unity terrain it actually uses uh, the raw format. So we'll click on raw for the file format and we'll save it in the exact same folder in our terrains uh, folder here and I'm just going to save it as our terrain height map. Save that, click OK and that is it. We have our map generated, we have it saved and now we can actually hop into Unity, set up our project, import all the assets we need and begin to create our terrain. 